Good afternoon, Amy. A 17-year-old boy crashed early Monday morning in New Hampshire after leading police on a chase that began in Massachusetts, officials said. Massachusetts State Police said the pursuit began around 12.15 a.m. when a Medford woman flagged down a trooper to report that her car had been stolen in Malden. She was tracking the red 2014 Toyota through the location of her cell phone. Troopers said the stolen car exited from I-93 onto I-95 northbound before several cruisers caught up with it. The troopers activated their lights and said the driver began to pull over before oscillating away suddenly. The young driver was able to m maneuver around tire deflation devices deployed by troopers and at time shut off the Camry's lights in an attempt to invade pursuit, state police said. New Hampshire State Police joined the chase at the state border around 12.48 a.m., officials said. The Camry took the ramp off I-95 and entered Route 101. New Hampshire State Police said that the vehicle took the ramp off Exit 11 in Stratham too fast and crashed around 1 a.m. He was found and arrested a few minutes later, police said. The teenager was taken to Exeter Hospital for treatment of minor injuries. The teenager, who was not identified because of his age, does not have a driver's license. State police said he will face charges including failure to stop for police, neglecting operation of a motor vehicle, and receiving a stolen motor vehicle. Reporting live here in Stratham, New Hampshire, I'm Riley King for WMUR News 9. Amy, back over to you.